please just work. Just want one video where nothing breaks or anything like that. Just, just one. Just, just one. Anyways, as you can see here, we're back on Modern Warfare and we got a uh, platinum sniper rifles now. I did quite a few guns the other day. Right now, I'm working on the bison here. I started last night and we're already pretty much almost done with it. This thing, I haven't really been trying to do its challenges. Uh, more so, I've just been running around using this thing. This thing is so much fun to actually use. Like, no, it's not the best SMG in the game or anything like that. It's just ridiculously fun. This is the uh, class setup I got going for it just for just pretty much making it as fast as I possibly can. ADS speed, movement speed, and hip firing. I got this... Pila, Pila, Pila thing on here as well. Uh, it's really only level, what, level 9. This thing is not the best. Uh, I hadn't realized. I mean, it, it didn't click for me. I, I knew that you had to get kills with the rocket launchers and all that to get them gold or diamond or whatever. But I put this thing on and realized that, yeah, its first thing is literally just getting 125 kills. Like, it's not shooting anything down or anything like that. No, it, it's getting infantry kills with this fucking thing. But as you can see here, we got the platinum sniper rifles now. So all my marksman rifles are done. All of the snipers are done. Shotguns have been done. Uh, we finished the AUG here as well. Yes, yeah, so we got the odd gold here, and then we also have the Uzi done here as well. So the, the, the Uzi was, it wasn't too bad. I honestly did. I, I didn't think I was going to like it. Once, once you get attachments on it, it's not that bad. But yeah, really, I've just been sitting here queuing a uh, hard hat. I mean, it's starting to play a little bit better after a few days. People are realizing, you know, how the map should be played. People are starting to run around and getting out of their corners a little bit. You still get those lobbies every so often where people just still don't want to move. But I've been playing hardcore just as I'm doing the SMG. I'll probably do ARs and core. It won't be too bad. But I've also been sitting here other than just domination. I've had like regular like just team deathmatch domination headquarters and stuff like that queued in here as well. Just to, just in the hopes that I sit here and could possibly get like shipment or shoot house or anything like that. It happens a few times. I'll even take like Hackneyard and Gunrunner. Just the smaller base maps that actually do play pretty well. This guy called me a cheater last game because I got a nuke. Well, don't worry, buddy. We'll probably sit here and just fucking drop 30 more kills on him. Let's do it again. Run it back what we're doing that's what we have fun doing just fucking uh, ads walking on b gotta love it man but anyways while i've been sitting here actually sitting down and going for all these camos and stuff i i, I realized something that uh, we don't have in this call of duty that we have actually had in almost every i think every call of duty since black ops 3 this pila takes so fucking long to reload man it's actually ridiculous but i realized that like with this call of duty this was supposed to be the game where you could make your gun yours you could customize it to, to your play style and everything like that you could make all these different attachments you could put on all this different stuff all these different weapon kits like you were supposed to be able to make this make your weapon your own but they probably didn't give us the most customizable thing you possibly could have and they didn't give us paint jobs like, I get Infinity Ward hasn't been the one that to give us all of our customizable stuff. Like, looking at it, black, like, all the Treyarch games really do have a... Uh, they got a bit more customization going for them. Okay, yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did the trophy system just defend my fucking rocket? Like, I can understand it getting rid of grenades and flashbangs, but I'm shooting an anti-vehicle missile. But you're telling me this little tripod is preventing me from destroying the entire corner of that map? What the fuck is wrong with you? Hello? Bitch, fuck you. Like, honestly, actually, if I think back, I did Infinite Warfare actually have paint jobs? I don't remember. I don't think they actually had a custom emblem editor or anything like that either. Yeah, no, Infinite Warfare didn't have paint jobs either. They, they had them in World War II, but not in Infinite Warfare. But sitting here, like, I mean, you would assume Infinity War would finally, you know, make that change and give it to us. It's the game where you can make your gun yours. And I mean, what better way to do that than literally letting you make your own camo? Especially with the already pretty dog shit selection we have on this game. I'll find a new lobby, I don't care. I will admit I've had that problem lately playing this game. I back out of a lot of lobbies now. Like, I just don't care to sit here and play against these kind of players. Like, it's insane how I can go from a 62 plus kill game on Domination Hard Hat to having like a 12 kill game max without the entire lobby on the exact same map in the exact same game mode. The Godsend. Domination on Rust! This is, this is why. This is the exact reason I keep these other game modes in the playlist. Just for this sole fucking purpose. I don't get it. Like, you, how can you make a map this small and compact still play this fucking bad? Please, just move! Your catch. And that he's using fucking EOD, man. I, I'm so tired. Just 
still back there. I just keep shooting rockets, and there's always at least one person there. I don't understand, man. Watch, I'm gonna do it again. There's gonna be at least one kill. Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, yeah, sure, I started just pushing their shit in, but I mean, the game just honestly didn't want to flip their spawns. I kind of feel bad. But anyways, when it comes to the whole paint job things, I don't get, like, why they didn't pick it up this year. I mean, sure, maybe they could have, it could have been because of the new engine or whatever, but I mean, realistically, they really, paint jobs really should have been a part of this game. It would have been amazing. Especially how you could have made them look like you, like how in Black Ops 3 you had, like, uh, the material pickers or something like that, right? With how beautiful everything in this game, like, just imagine you could put, like, a glossy finish over your paint job or a gritty finish or something like that. They could have done so much that it could have looked so good. Especially with just how great this game looks in general. But instead, we got fucking stickers of weapon charms and a slap on the wrist. But hey, then again, it wouldn't be Call of Duty otherwise, right? I'm just gonna fucking hit marker with an RPG, dude. Are you kidding me? Anyways, I'm gonna go on ahead and leave the video there, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I should be able to get this Uzi done today. I'll probably finish something else. Maybe, probably even start a third weapon. But the P90 is the only SMG I have left other than this Bison here. So I should be able to get all the SMGs done and then probably start an AR or an LMG. Probably an AR. I don't know if I want to do the LMGs yet because they, they really do just suck. I might start pistols. There, actually, use, I got the Deagle Gold. That was really fun. Uh, I, I kind of want to wait for like the shoot the ship type playlist to come back first before I do that, though. Don't get me wrong. It's, I, I could probably do it on hard hat. It's not gonna be bad or anything like that. But I just feel like though, it's just gonna go by so much faster on those maps. I just know it. But yep, that's gonna do it for me. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Leave a like if you guys haven't already. Drop a comment down below there as well if you guys have any other uh, video ideas for me, any games you want to see me play, or any uh, just content ideas in general. I might, I might try a new, uh, a, a new video style type thing here in the future. I got the idea for it last night. It probably won't be something that I do uh, all the time or indefinitely. It, it might be. It, it's something that I. It, it seems like it's going to be fun for me to do, and it's funner and easier and better for me to record. So I'll probably make that video here uh, pretty soon. It'll probably take me a little bit before I can actually, you know, push it out. I'm going to still make all these other regular videos before all that and keep you guys posted with, you know, me getting this Damascus camo. I know it's like seven, eight months into the game, but. But why not? You know, there's nothing else to do. I'm enjoying playing the game right now. And well, let's see if anyone just wants to come by, stop by and see the progress I'm making and the fucking mental I'm putting myself through. It's just not, it's not going to be okay. Like I, I sit here playing this game and I, my IQ just fucking drops lower and lower. My reaction time actually does get worse. Like play Modern Warfare and then try and go play any other Call of Duty. You're going to be much worse at that one because you've been conditioned on this game to be just slower overall. But yeah, that does it for me. Be sure to stop uh, on the next video. Right now I'm just uploading every other day instead of every single day. I, that, that, that for me is a thing that I don't think I want to do right now. I always wanted to. I did it for a little bit, but like it takes a lot longer for me to make these videos when all my stuff decides to break and just be scuffed and I didn't realize that I took that off there now the lighting's better yeah be sure to stop by with two days we'll have another video up for you guys and every other day from there on but yeah peace